Hi, welcome back to EducateTube.com. My name is Sipski, your host. Today I'll be showing you how to build a miniature lab film hood. For example, if you want to do a chemistry experiment or a science experiment in a controlled condition and safe environment, this is what you would need. Okay, so very easy. All you need is a fish tank and a ventilation duct system like this uh, duct uh, tube. Okay, and I'll show you other material you need as well. Let's get started. Okay, so what you need is a uh, duct system. This is a T-shaped uh, aluminum duct connectors. So this is this side here will go outside where it's connected to the tube, right? Aluminum tube. This is where ordinary where the um, the washing the uh, dryer uh, air flow in and out. And on this side, what we're going to do is we're going to connect the film hood on this side. Okay. There's also a there's going to be a plate where actually um gonna prevent the air from flowing into this side right into the dryer so we want to the the uh, fan to blow the air out to outside okay so you need a um, fish tank you also need a fan that will suck in the air and blow it out into the ventilation system okay you need a base like a table I'm using air hockey uh, table that's uh, was given to me they don't use it anymore so I'm using that as well okay so that's all you really need a fish tank a ventilation uh, duct system okay a fan right and an aluminum duct fan connector to suck in the air and it's gonna driven it all the way through this uh, duct connector and then going outside all right that's all we need let's get started I'll show you how to put them together as you can see here my fish tank one of the front glass is removed I did it myself, but I won't recommend it for anyone to do that. It's pretty messy and you have to be uh, pretty safe to do it. And I did that. I used all the safety precaution, but it was a lot of work. So like I said, I, I recommend you get someone who does tank design to do this for you. It shouldn't cost you more than uh, 50 bucks for this size, maybe more for a bigger size. This is in the base uh, where I'm going to put my... Um film hood on top of okay it's actually made of uh, uh, plywood uh, it's actually a ho air hockey stick actually I put an, uh, on a, a, another layer of plywood on top of it to uh, insulate it and then on the bottom of the uh, film hood there's also glass so there's a multiple layer of safety features um, on this portable film hood that I'm making okay so I made a aluminum plate put it on top of the fish tank. Uh, I cut a, ho a hole, a uh, circle. That's where the air vent will sit, right? The air duct system will sit with the fan. And then I hot glue the edges so that there's no uh, air that will escape from that. So I use a plastic and hot glue to seal the edges. As you can see, the film hood was almost completed. The air vent with the fan, as you can see, sucked the air through these uh, duct film duct and go all the way around the tube and all the way outside right hook up to outside so the the fan you have to have a very good one so it can suck the air out okay now it's completed you can see there is a plastic that's like a mesh that goes across the transparency I use a drape plastic drape transparent draped and I cut into rectangular pieces so I can go in there and you know put in the chemical and it will self-seal. Now this is not the perfect type. Okay, and then there's a uh, fan that sucks in the uh, air, the fume, and it goes all the way into the vent and to the outside. So it's completed. Converting my um, aquarium tank, rectangular aquarium tank, into a portable film hood for chemistry experiment and other type of science experiment. Pretty cool. Let's, let's give it a try now.
Okay, the last thing I did for the experiment was to burn a piece of paper, as you can see here. The air uh, flow was quite good. The uh, fan where you could suck all the smoke out and chew outside. But uh, like I said, uh, don't uh, overdo it. Use only a few grams of sample in the film hood and never use any toxic chemical to uh, uh, to be used in this type of uh, film hood. Alright, it's only meant for a small experiment. Thanks for watching EducateTube.com.